Now, this is a question I get all the time, especially when someone is reading through the book of Exodus or they happen upon those passages in Romans where Paul is talking about uh, God hardening Pharaoh's heart. Now, what most people do is they, they hear that God hardened Pharaoh's heart and they think that God is somehow taking Pharaoh's free will away from him. So the thought goes that, you know, God wanted to uh, rescue the Israelites out of Egypt and but he also wanted to punish Pharaoh. And so he, he hardened Pharaoh's heart so that the first time Moses and Aaron come to him, maybe Pharaoh would have let them go. But because God hardened his heart, uh, Pharaoh decided to not let them go. But that's a that's a flawed understanding of what it means to harden, uh, uh, to have a hardened heart. If you think about what it means to harden something, it actually means that you strengthen it. So one understanding of what it means to harden someone's heart is just to allow them to continue going in the direction that they want to go. It's almost like giving them wind behind their back, you know, and, and we see this happen all the time in the Bible. When God wants to punish someone, often God will just allow them to continue doing the thing that they want to do, and then they experience the consequences of it. So when we read that God hardened Pharaoh's heart, we shouldn't read that God took away Pharaoh's free will. But what, what we should understand is that God strengthened Pharaoh to do the exact thing that Pharaoh wanted to do anyways. Pharaoh is reaping the, the consequences of his own behavior and his own desires. That's what it means that he had a hardened heart. He wanted to do what he did and God just strengthened him so that he would do what he wanted to do. So then what does it mean for us to have hardened hearts? It's the same thing. When my heart is hardened towards someone, it's, it's me doing what I want to do. And that's why one of the things that we're supposed to pray, in fact, I believe it's in Psalm 51, where uh, David, uh, he says, create in me a clean heart, O God, a clean heart. That's a heart that wants to do what God wants us to do, a heart that beats for God instead of a heart that's beating after our own inclinations. So that's what it means to have a hardened heart.